interviewer. I'm the interviewer. You are all my interviewees. Favorite moment of the season thus far? Signing you. Oh, hey, boys. <laughs> yeah. I knew that was it. Going back into midfield, playing against oh, Dagenham. Midfield, midfield. There we go. That's a big. Yeah, that I'd cool. say beating Dagenham away from home. Beating Dagenham. Yeah. Not, not celebrating Keeper's goal like yours. No. No. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Most memorable Christmas present you've ever received? Uh, Doesn't look like too many. Do you know what? I, I'm struggling. I had a, I had a yeah. Commodore 64 one year. It was decent. What's that? What's that? <laughs> what is that? Yeah, what's that again? Yeah, alright then. You had one of them. That was that was the one just before the Xbox came out. Oh, okay. Yeah. To load it, you press shift, return, spacebar, F2, I think it was. And then you press play on the tape machine, the cassettes. And then, and then you get kind of an epileptic fit come up on the screen and the flash in. And then if it breaks down, it takes another 20 minutes to get it going again. That sounds fun. Some great games. Okay, so best goal of the season. That's fine. It's got to be Brett. Who would you make? Who would make the best Father Christmas on the first team? What about you, Boomer? I'll go with Ben Gary. Ben Gary. Yeah. yeah Is that for the belly, or he <laughs> need a specially made hat for his to head. fit his head? Describe your perfect Christmas day. Training on the morning, uh, <laughs> light workout in the afternoon, early night. Oh, there's presents as well in there. Now I've got kids, I get told that apparently I've got to be a lot more up for it. So I'm going to say opening presents for the children. Get up early, uh, nice coffee. I'm paying you too much if you go out for Christmas dinner. <laughs> Spending time with the family, misses. <laughs> the little one and the cat, mate. The cat. Yeah. I believe you've got a cat. <laughs> it's the missus I've it's got a problem like a with. Lion. Have you seen the best Christmas song? Don't Miss will turn white. Oh, don't. <laughs> I'll go with Mariah. What one's that? All I, All I want oh, for okay. Christmas. I'd probably say rocking around the Christmas tree. Sprouts? Yes or no? Yes. 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 No. No. Two out of three. We've just come up to the um, Louisa Carey Road at Torquay um, uh, to hand out a few presents, a little bit of Christmas cheer to any of the kids that are on here. Um, I said to our lads, because obviously it's something that's not always easy for lads to do, I made it optional and virtually all of them said yes and came along. It's been uh, really nice, it's good to see all the kids and their uh, smiles when giving them the presents. Um, we brought a bunch of footballs and um, I think every kid took one of those, so that was good. It's obviously like a tough time of year for, for parents, obviously with their, their kids in the ward, so uh, it's just nice to come in and give a little bit back. I'd like to say a big thank you to Vospers, a uh, big thank you to Sainsbury's, big thank you to Lavelle Sports and to Winners 2000 and Simon Jeffrey, because they've all put in uh, to make it that we've had that many gifts to give out, we've actually got some left. So I'm going to pop up again, I think, on Saturday and, and with a couple of the lads and go around and hand a few more bits out. Um, but I think it's just, it's nice for the kids, it's nice for the players to be able to, to give back a little bit. It's part of giving back to the community, which I've always spoken about and how important it is. Um, and if it puts a smile on one kid's face, then it was definitely worth it. And there's one or two kids knocking about here now smiling, which is great to see.